Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Bianca Moore with Be More Successful Marketing. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fulfill Shopify orders with Dropify. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is head on over to AliExpress and make sure that you are logged in because the only way that you are going to be able to fulfill the order through AliExpress is if your account is logged in. So as you can see, we are logged in here. Okay, then what you want to do is head on over to Dropify and you want to click on orders so that you can see the orders that have been placed through your store, all right? you want to go down to your most recent orders that have been placed through your store and it will show that it has not been fulfilled because it will say no products ordered all right and it'll have this little red dot here and it'll say unfulfilled all right so go ahead and click on place order and you can either go to step-by-step -step order or auto place order or auto choose shipping now if you choose auto choose shipping this will uh, allow you to choose the type of shipping that you want whether you want e-packet or if you want the aliexpress shipping or whatever type of shipping they offer all right so for the sake of this video i'm just going to go with step by step order and what this does is this will allow me to go ahead and select the type of um, style that I want uh, for the customer. So let me just go back and see which one they ordered. They ordered the eight hole. All right, so we'll go back to AliExpress and we will select the one that has eight holes. And that was this one, okay? And then what we'll do is we'll scroll down to continue auto order. Now what this is going to do is go ahead and put all of their shipping information in there. As you can see, it populated all of their information. And after that, what we're going to do is continue um, onto the next page by clicking on confirm and pay. Now it may ask for your Alipay password and you should have created a password through Alipay. If you have not, you may want to go to uh, Google and type in Alipay and they will give you step-by-step -step direction on how to do that exactly. All right, so I'm just going to go and place my Alipay password in there. And then I am going to click on pay now. And that's it. That's all you have to do. It says thank you for your payment. And now it's processed. All right. So now we just have to wait on the ship, uh, the vendor to actually update the order. We'll go back to order details. And once they have received the payment and everything, what they're going to do is go ahead and um, add the tracking number, okay? And you will get a notification showing that they have actually added a tracking number onto this order so that you can notify your customer. And you'll see the tracking number updated right here. So you'll go to tracking over to the left and all you have to do is sync with AliExpress and it will automatically update the tracking information for you. As you can see, all of these tracking numbers are in there for my customer. All right, and then I'm just going to refresh the page. And now what I'm going to do is fulfill these orders um, in my actual Shopify store by clicking on fulfill because now I have the tracking information. So I'll click on fulfill and send shipping confirmation email to customer. You want to make sure that this says yes. And what we'll do is click on fulfill order. Now this fulfills the order 
completely through Dropify and Shopify. All right, and you just want to do that to the other ones that have the tracking information. It already says yes, fulfill order. Now your customers are receiving an email with the tracking information. All right, so they shouldn't be emailing you about uh, where their order is because now they have the tracking information uh, and the link to actually check on the status of their order. All right, and these are usually updated within, you know, 24 to 48 hours. So once the vendor has actually sent the item, this one will be updated and I'll be able to send that information to the customer as well. Now, I did have one more order, so let me just run through this again for you. This is complete. So I'll go ahead and remove that. And this was the last order that I had. And I'm just gonna go to step-by-step -step order. And it was a six hole. So we'll select the six hole. And we'll continue auto order. It's going to go ahead and place the customer's address and go to the next page. And all I have to do is confirm and pay. You can see they did not ask me for my Alipay information this time because I put it in the last time. And all I have to do now is just pay. And now that order is placed successfully and I'm just waiting on the tracking information. So I hope this video was very helpful to um, give you the best instruction for how to fulfill Shopify orders with Dropify. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I drop another video with Shopify tips and tricks for you to excel in your Shopify business. I'll see you guys in the next video.